I wanted to do a quick how-to video on putting on a swimming cap. Um, I think that swimming hats are great inventions. Uh, you do need to take care of them because sometimes they can be a little bit easy to break. So making sure you're keeping really good care of your hats, um, especially if you find one that you really like uh, and there's nothing worse than, than the hat that you really love breaking and then having to find a new one because some hats are made from silicon, some hats are made from latex and it really just depends on uh, on what you have. So this, this hat from the Winter Swim Challenge um, from Zogs is a latex hat. Um, I prefer specifically using silicon hats myself. Uh, they just feel a little bit nicer on my hair uh, whilst I'm swimming. But anyway, back to the point, the how-tos. So a couple of things why I think uh, swimming hats are really helpful. So if you're gonna be swimming in a swimming pool and it's chlorinated, swimming with the hat will really help to keep your hair a little bit healthier. So the chlorine can really dry your hair out and that's the same for ladies and for gents. So if you're gonna be swimming a lot, in a swimming pool, not wearing a swimming hat, you'll find that your hair really suffers as a result. So putting on a cap will go a long way in helping your hair stay a little healthier. The other reason why it's really good, certainly for people that have long hair, is that it can keep your hair out of your face while you're swimming. There's nothing worse than trying to take your breath to the side and getting a bit of, a, of your hair stuck in your mouth. It's just, it's not helpful. I don't think anyone needs that distraction. And the third thing why in a swimming pool it's super helpful to wear swimming hats is if you've ever swam through a stray hairball, it's pretty gross. So it's a really good thing for everyone involved if everyone wears swimming hats when we go to swimming pools. In the open water, especially now that it's getting really cold, swimming hats are really helpful to just kind of keep a little bit of heat in your head. We lose quite a lot of heat out of our head, so if you can put a swimming cap on, it will help you uh, reduce the heat loss just a little bit more. So now to the actual how-to video. So if like me, you have long hair, um, I find the easiest way to manage putting on a swimming cap and keeping everything in there is essentially to tie my hair up. And I don't tie it up how I normally would have it tied up, which is up here. I try, tend to tie it into the, the lower part or the, the, this kind of back part of my neck just there because that's where I want it to sit whilst I'm swimming. I don't want it to sit where it normally would do because that's where I want my goggles that's where my goggle straps will be. And if they are on top of the hairband, it can sometimes be really annoying or your goggles feel really tight um, unnecessarily. So now to the how-tos. If you're thinking, how am I supposed to put this hat on by myself if I don't have anyone there? Well, that's exactly what I'm gonna show you. So to start off with, um, the first thing to know about hats is that the way they go on your head is that the seam that goes around the middle of them, that goes kind of around the middle part of your head here. You can wear them that way, but it kind of adds a bit more drag because these bits kind of sit out a little bit funny on the side. So they are technically meant to go this way round. So this bit goes around the middle part of your head. So if you're on your own and you don't have someone that can help you, what you do is you put both hands into the hat like that. Now the aim is for this bit at the front, this bit here needs to sit on your forehead. So we go like that. And then what you do is you just pull the hat around your head. And without doing too much, you can see that most of my hair is already tucked in. But what you can do here is just tuck it in around like that and tuck in any strays that you need. And you can see that my hairband is down right at the bottom part of my, uh, well, top part of my neck there, I guess. And it means that my goggles are not gonna kind of be uh, annoyed. Well, I'm not gonna be annoyed about my goggles sitting on top of my hairline. And that is pretty much how you put on a swimming cap. <laughs> 